Hey guys, going to do a video on the new generation Gen 5 engines, the ones that came out in 2020 on the new body styles, the LE4, the LE7, the LE2, and the LAT. So right now, I'm going to discuss the cost of licensing the computers and how this works. So we're going to go to products, and HP tuners. And we're going to look at a few things here. First, you'll need to buy the MPBI3 uh, programming device. If you already have one, great. If not, you're going to purchase this. So there's uh, $400. Uh, we'll talk about the credits in uh, just a moment. Next, we're going to find the ECU. So we got the E90 ECU here. Uh, very important, this is going to tell you what's uh, possible to do. So we have E90 and the E93. Now, this note means everything right here. These are what is accepted. That means these are the ones that are able to manually unlock and program. If you do not have this service number on the back of your ECU there, Said it'd be on the other side. Uh, we can't do it. There's no way to program it. So we're looking for these uh, service numbers here. Again, 2019 and 2022s are supported. So you flip that over and compare these two numbers. Right here is going to ask you what controller. And there's an upgrade and a purchase. Uh, I really only want to do these if you have your original ECU and TCM. So we'll do upgrade. Basically, we're sending the ECU to them, and uh, they unlock it manually. If you are missing your ECU, you have to know the VIN number, and they can uh, supply a new ECM. So $700 if you're missing that ECU or ECM. And right now, we're going to look at this price. It's $450 for them to unlock it. Now we're going to scroll down here and get to some uh, kind of bad news here. So for the upgrade right here, like I said, it's 450. You're also required to license it to your HP Tuners device. That's eight credits, which means $400. So right now you have $850 to just do your ECM. Okay. Again, no one else is doing this. They can charge whatever they want. So it's going to be $850 um, plus the tuning device if you don't have it, the MPBI3, which is $400. So that's $1,250 to do your ECU to make your engine run. Now, that's one part of it, right? So there's your ECU. This will get you up and running. Now we're going to go to the TCM, the T93. All right, here, same situation basically. You want to check that out. It says they don't accept this special service number. So again, you're going to want to do the uh, unlock unlock it and it's going to keep the original programming um, if you send them a blank one that's where you need the unlock and programming service if you don't have anything at all you can do the purchase which will mean they'll supply the TCM and unlock it for 400 so right now for most people this is going to be uh, $200 all right let's scroll down here all right got you again they're going to ask for four credits. That's two hundred dollars. So you're going to have two hundred here to unlock it, and two hundred dollars to license it. That's four hundred dollars. Okay, we're already at twelve fifty. So now the total is sixteen fifty to do this. Now, if you go through me to do the harness and programming, everything has to get shipped there and back. So Shipping has to pay, be paid both ways plus taxes. So then you're at another $100. So you're at $1,650. You're at 
and I'm not going to program this for free, right? So um, I need to charge a few hundred dollars on top of that. So you're at seventeen fifty. You're about what's rounded to nineteen hundred dollars. So to program your your uh, ECU and TCM is going to be anywhere from sixteen fifty to uh, nineteen fifty. Again, you got taxes and you got shipping both ways. So and they're they, they're not cheap. To, I mean, shipping is going to be about thirty bucks each way. So um, just letting you guys know the deal on these and how pricey it is. But if this is what you have and this is what you want, that's how it's going to work. So just be aware of that, guys. Um, again, going over the programming costs. And this cost is if you already have both modules. If you're missing them, you can see the price. You know, you can be up to about uh, $2,200 if you're missing the ECU and TCM. And it's it'd be a good thing not to be missing those. So that's the cost on that. Um, I do have the LE7 and 10 speed working. And uh, I get a lot of requests on this. And this is why most people don't want to mess with these is the cost of doing these modules. It's uh, quite a bit more. But again, uh, just going over the cost, exactly what you're getting. And just trying to inform you guys on what's going on with these new generation engines. Thanks for watching.